So you wanna use AI generated content in your website. The problem is Google has strict guidelines about this. They flag AI generated content and will make it rank lower. So how do you get around these detectors? Well, in this video, I'm gonna show you how to do that. So let's get into it. So here in ChatGPT, I'm gonna be making my article for my website. The article I want is going to be about a cloud scatter cushion. Make sure you're being very specific when you're making an article, because if you make an article about something generic, like say a leather strap, it's gonna be almost impossible to make that sort of article undetected by algorithms. So just make sure when you're asking for these articles, you are very specific. So if the article you want is for a product, make sure like you can include more like colors, textures, if it's made by a specific company, try and include that into the article so you can really make the article more unique that makes it easier for you to go around these detectors so let's do that now here in ChatGPT. so what i've asked ChatGPT is to give me an article for a cloud scatter cushion it's made from toweling fabric and it's for a child's bedroom so you can see i'm being very specific here so here's the first draft of that article that it gave me so, but I feel like it's a little bit too small. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna ask it to make it a little bit longer. So what I'm asking is to rewrite this article to be over a thousand words. Okay, so now it's given me an article that's over a thousand words, which is perfect. So now the next step we're gonna do is we're gonna test it out in an AI detector. So I'm gonna highlight, I'm gonna copy this whole thing. And then the first detector I'm gonna be using is content at scale. And they have an AI detector that's very good at this sort of thing. So I'm going to put the article here. And at the bottom of the page, I'm going to say check for AI content. Now because you're so specific, it's going to be a little bit more tricky for these detectors to actually see that it's fake. And as you can see, this detector couldn't really see that the article is fake. It was because of that fact that we were very specific. But let's make sure on the second detector. So the second detector that I'm using is from writer.com. Here I'm going to paste the article as well. The only problem with this detector, that it only takes one and a half thousand characters. And because I made the article longer, I won't be able to analyze the whole article which is still fun and as you can see even this one it passes so now let's just use something that's a bit more generic so we can show you how to bypass in case your article comes into that problem for the second article i'm going to ask ChatGPT to write an article about how to make money online okay so now that it's given me the article i'm going to copy and paste this into an ai detector and let's analyze this as you can see it says 100 percent fake so now I'm going to go into something called a content rephrase. Now this is from a company called Writesonic. So what it does is it rephrases the article but preserves the meaning. So let's put it into here. I'm going to say generate. Here you do have different options of changing the voice, so the tone, and the quality of the words that you want to produce. Now it's going to give me three different options that I can choose from. So now that it's rewritten the article, I think I'm going to choose this first one. I'm going to go over to the AI detector. I'm going to put it over here. I'm going to say check for AI content. And there we go. 100% real. So now that content rephrase has actually made the article article undetectable let's just double check on a second detector so here in writer.com i'm going to test that article that was rewritten in content rephrase just to double check that it was not detected i'm going to say analyze text and there we go 98 percent human generated content so now we can take that article that we rephrased and we can put it into our blog post knowing that google is not going to rank the article lower because it detected ai content so now remember that the more specific you are the better the quality of the article is going to be i hope you like this quick video if you have any questions or anything please drop a comment down below and I'll see you in the next one. Cheers.